Hey everybody, welcome back, it's Max here. Today we're gonna to talk about an important wintery subject and that is humidity and the lack of humidity and how humidity can actually affect your guitar's performance in the winter months. So if you're interested in something like that, stick around and we'll talk about it. So what is humidity and why is it so important? Humidity is the amount of moisture that you get in the air. In the winter months, the thing that happens is we start heating up our homes, our studios. I'm heating up this room here where I teach and record music. And what happens is the level of moisture goes down. It could go down to like 25%. Now, what is an ideal percentage for your guitars? Well, they say it's between 40% and 60. I like to stick between 45 and 50% humidity. Um, and I find that guitars feel very nice when that's the case. So what are some of the side effects of having low humidity? Well, I've experienced one side effect on this guitar and that is sharp frets. What happens in the winter months is the wood tends to shrink because again, there is less humidity. And what happens is the frets start sticking out and when you're playing, it becomes very uncomfortable to move around. Another side effect of having a dry guitar is that the top could actually crack. The lacquer, or even in worst case, the wood itself could start cracking. Let's talk about some solutions for humidity issues or lack of humidity issues. Get yourself a humidifier. You can get some guitar humidifiers that fit right between the strings for acoustic guitars. They're like little sacks, you fill them up with water, uh, usually distilled water actually. So distilled water, you put it in and I think you may have to refill it once every few days, something like that. So that's one option. Second option, and this works great for electric guitars or electric basses, is to get a case humidifier. And it's almost the exact same thing. It's a pouch, you fill it up with water, but instead of sticking it inside a sound hole, electric guitars don't have that, uh, you put it in your case and it keeps your case humidified. The only downside to something like that is that your guitar has to stay in the case. Third option, and this is the option that I use, is to actually get a room humidifier. It's a standalone humidifier and it keeps your entire room humid. This is perfect for anybody that is keeping all of their guitars out and that is somebody like me. I don't like keeping my guitars in cases because I think I have the lazy guitar, guitarist syndrome, and that is if the guitar is in the case, I don't play it. It's the whole thing of going out and picking up the case, putting it down, opening it up, getting the guitar out, closing the case, putting it away. I know it sounds kind of silly, but I keep my guitars out on the, uh, on the stand. That way, when I grab it, it's just right there. No case is nothing. So as you can tell, I like to keep my guitars out. They're all under stands. Uh, I have a hydrometer, which is telling me that it's 47% humidity in this room. Now, it takes me two humidifiers to do that. One wasn't cutting it, so I got two. Do whatever it takes to keep your guitars in good shape. For me, it takes two humidifiers. All right, and here's a side effect of a top cracking on this ukulele and that's due to lack of humidity, something you definitely want to avoid. So in conclusion, get yourself a humidifier, whichever one it is, do yourself a favor, humidify your instruments, it's gonna save you a lot of money and your instruments will feel nice all the time. It's one of the best things you can do for them in the winter time. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.